Hi artists! Today we are going to be talking about a new type of art called calligraphy. You were taught how to print letters and write in cursive in school. I'm sure you've seen someone else write before and thought that their handwriting was beautiful. Maybe it's a classmate or your teacher or your parent that writes really well. People have loved beautiful handwriting and have been turning it into art for a very long time. Calligraphy is the art of handwriting. Calligraphy is all about making letters look beautiful or to create a mood. You can find calligraphy all over the world. Here are some examples from online encyclopedias of calligraphy from Persia, Egypt, China, and England from long ago. But people still make calligraphy today, too. There are many reasons why artists make calligraphy. This could be signs for businesses, invitations and cards, important documents, religious reasons, to decorate their homes, or to share famous sayings or quotes that inspire others. An artist that makes calligraphy is called a calligrapher. Calligraphers use special tools to write their art. These tools can include traditional pens by dipping a pointed metal tip in a bottle of ink, or they may use brushes with the ink. Tools that are more popular today would be markers or ballpoint pens. We are going to learn about a famous American calligrapher. Mohammed Zakaria was born in 1942 in California, in the United States of America. He learned Arabic and calligraphy as a young man. He had to copy his teacher's handwriting exactly to become a master calligrapher. Zachariah not only writes very well in Arabic, he also makes all of his own tools. Here are four examples of Zachariah's work. His work is important because the United States government has asked him to make several pieces. President Obama, who was president before President Trump, asked Zachariah to make the green and beige work of art on the right as a gift for the country of Saudi Arabia. Zachariah was also hired to design three stamps for the United States Postal Service. These stamps are holiday stamps for different Eids, including the end of Ramadan. Next week, I will show you some fun types of calligraphy for kids to try. You can write your name or a favorite saying and display it in your home as calligraphy art.